Hey guys, so right now I am on the Pocket 3 and you are listening to the DJI Mic 2 transmitter that comes in the creator combo. So I'm gonna give you a comparison today of what it sounds like using this transmitter as well as using just the internal microphones on the Pocket 3. There are actually three different internal microphones located up on the handle. Uh, you do have to be careful that you don't cover those up, so we will talk about that as well. And I am also gonna cover in a bit here, I'm gonna go next to a fountain and kind of show you, you know, what that sounds like when there's a little bit more kind of ambient noise going around. Right now there is some wind around me, you know, we're going through this little kind of woodsy area. Uh, so you can hear, I mean, there are some birds chirping in the background and subtle wind and things like that. But I wanna show you because there's definitely some draw to being able to just use this without having to use an external microphone and you know, not having to deal with clipping or magnetting this back onto my shirt every single time. Uh, if you're traveling, just being able to pull this out of your pocket, you know, and be able to use those internal mics. It's definitely pretty attractive. So this is what it sounds like actually using just the internal microphones on the Pocket 3 now. So as I mentioned, there's three of them. They are up pretty high on the handle, but if you aren't watching where you're placing your hands, well, right now I'm using the one extension piece to this. Uh, if you have the mini tripod as well from the Creator Combo, that definitely helps because then it gets your hand away from that a little bit. It just makes it easier to hold in general because it's a pretty small device. I don't have the biggest hands and I think if you're someone who does have big hands, it's definitely going to be kind of hard to try to hold this without covering up the microphones. You know, I've seen countless other creators that use this for like vlogging and that cover up the microphones and it definitely does mess up your audio. You could really hear it. So here we are again, just to show you back to the DJI Mic 2 transmitter. So that is where the audio is now coming from again. So as I mentioned, you just have to kind of think about your process a little more if you're using this transmitter. You can clip it onto the carrying case here, but it does take up more room. You know, it hangs on your shirt here and everything. Um, it's gonna sound probably a little bit better, but for run and gun type setups, if you wanna just be able to pull this out and start using it, it's a little bit more cumbersome. It's just another thing you have to do. You also have to consider if you're gonna turn that microphone on and off every time you're placing it, or if you kinda of just leave it on as you're you know, out and about then. Here's one more test out in the open. This is with a little bit of wind actively going on right now, and this is on the DJI Mic 2 transmitter. And here's with just the internal microphones of the Osmo Pocket 3. There is a little bit of light breeze going on at the moment. So right now it's a bit windy and you can see I have this fountain over here behind me, which is actually pretty loud. So here's a test using the external DJI Mic 2 transmitter to see what this sounds like and how well it does with deadening some of this wind and that sound behind me. And here's what it sounds like again with the wind. It's pretty breezy here right now. That fountain behind me is pretty loud. And this is just using those three microphones built into the handle of the Pocket 3. So let me know what you think about the difference between using an external mic like this and using the internal mics of the DJI Pocket 3. I think a big thing it comes down to is whether or not you're getting that creator combo and you're getting this microphone included. I did because I'm gonna use this for more professional purposes and product reviews and things like that. Uh, if you're going to be getting far away from this too, that's another major factor. If you're walking, you know, 100 feet away from this, obviously you're going to want an external microphone because then the internal mics are definitely not going to be picking up you from that far away. If you want to know more about that creator combo and whether that's maybe for you or not, check out this video right here that's popping up. I did a pretty comprehensive review on it. Please like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe for more DJI Osmo Pocket 3 content.